Good morning! We are out in the back hills of Durbanville at the moment. Cameron and Misha just jumped in their car. They're on the N1 heading sort of northeast. We've come to get the sunrise here, but we're gonna go meet up with them now along the road somewhere. Obviously, we've got the car to play with. We've got cool people, good looking people with us. This is gonna be an epic shoot. This is how you make a travel video. What a what a nice sunrise! <laughs> That's a big trunk, man. Yeah, we're gonna see how many bodybuilders we can fit in here. We actually have everybody in the same location, uh, but this is not where we're shooting. We're at a trucker stop. Let's move on. Yeah. Please don't kill us. together with those guys for a completely different reason than actually making a video with them. And we, we just collaborated because they're travelers. So why is collaboration important in the first place? Ask those guys. So collaborations can literally be one of the most powerful ways to grow your audience. We're going to talk about collaborations, one of the most popular topics on YouTube for a good reason. They help channels grow. So why is it important to collaborate? Well, there are quite a few benefits. Number one is that you get yourself in front of a new audience. YouTube collaborations can be one of the fastest ways of growing your YouTube channel. And now back to this collaboration. A shot of all of you like walking up the stairs together and then coming to the edge from that side in like a nice long row, like just to get a bit of a who's here, who's who, what's happening. Who's who, what's going on? So line up. Three, two, one, go. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> That was classic. I thought that was way further away. You get that? Yep. Yes! I never realized you were lying. One of the most important parts to get a cool travel video is always going to be the location. You know, once you get to a place like this that just looks unique and interesting, you can just clown around, mess around, have fun. Alright guys, so just to clarify, so how is this group came together? So it's pretty easy. So Norbert is working with Cameron. And I met Cameron because I was sitting in Schecter's and I was talking with Sal, which somehow knows Cameron. Therefore, but those guys already knew Dean before I knew him. But because I was drinking coffee with Jibril in Bali and talking with him about his friend Mike in a previous collaboration. Mike, what's happening today? What's Break. up? We're gonna go sandboarding today. And now back to this collaboration. I asked Mike if he can uh, hook me up with some tours, and somehow he recommended me this guy here. Got some good shots. We're gonna go head off to Babylon's tour now to do the gardens and some coffee. Now the cool thing is, we've got two cameras, so Norbert can be on the one side of the car, I'm on the other side of the car. San Diego for eight years and the best most happy points of my life in that eight years when I was always traveling so I had an opportunity to get rid of everything I own and be able to travel full-time and I was about to move to Miami I went there for a week and absolutely hated it and decided you know what this is my one chance to just be like you know I can go travel do whatever I want with no strings attached back home so it was definitely one of the best decisions of my life say you have to have a pulling argument like something has to pull you in this direction like like for me waking up in the morning and knowing I have to bust my ass in the gym or like take a 12-hour flight 
it's like I, I know what is there. I know what's waiting for me there. I can imagine and visualize myself and that makes it way easier for me. And there's people, they can do that. They think like, they, they just think about all the problem who could happen. Like they're already like overthinking it and that's why they're never gonna experience it because in the moment you're doing it, it's always nice. Like in this morning, 5 a.m. I woke up, I was like, Oh my god, this is gonna be. Oh, uh, you know, but now I fucking love it. So it's it's always like even for me a challenge. It it's always a challenge. Every morning you wake up like oh, oh my god, yeah, yeah. It's like a little mind game. Yeah, I'm from Asia. I'm from Switzerland. Switzerland. Whoa. We met in Cape Town. <laughs> and we just decided that traveling is the key. Is um, yeah. you just gotta take the step and you gotta find your own motivation. Like why, you know? So connecting with you guys is the best thing ever. Those guys live a nomadic life at the moment and they're traveling the world still with a business. So you can't give up everything, we've mentioned that before, and just move around the world with no income. These guys are doing it, they have legitimate businesses, they work really, really hard to make it work. We've also got a legitimate business and we work hard as well. And we wanted to hang out with those like-minded people and that's the reason we made this video. Your entertainment and to hang out with the right kind of people is important. One of the things is that we're fixed in Cape Town because we want to be. This is where we, everything that we're meeting about is actually, it's taking place here. But we will unroll this in the rest of the world and we need to collaborate with other like-minded people in the travel video making world. So that's why we're sharing it with you and that's why we're hanging out with you at the moment to share our skill set, grow our business, share with you what other people are doing to grow their businesses. If you are in Cape Town and you want to come hang out with us and do a shoot like this, open invitation to anybody traveling the world coming to the city. We know our way around here. We're inviting you to come play with us. So all you digital nomads out there or whatever you do, Come and join us, we'd love to make a video with you and we'd love to hang out in Cape Town and share time with like-minded people. Check out the video we made for Misha on his channel. If you want us to help you make better travel videos, contact us when you're in Cape Town or subscribe for more helpful tips coming soon.